Hi everyone. Let's start with the today's lecture where we will continue our previous lesson as we have done the affirmative sentences of simple present tense in previous part of the video. So in this part of the lecture we'll discuss the answers of an exercise that I gave you at the end of that video. Now let's start the discussion of your answers. So for your first answer is goes because my sister is a singular subject so here subject is my sister that's why we'll use s or es with first form of verb as i have told you the verb that end in o so we'll use es to make it plural fine okay next answer is stay your second question's answer is stay we dash at home on Mondays. We stay at home on Mondays. We is a plural subject here. So, we will use only first form of verb. No S or ES. Okay. Your third answer is works. My father dash in a bank. My father works in a bank. My father is one person singular subject. So, we will use only S or ES with first form of verb. So, works. Next, your fourth number question's answer is read. Her friends always read books. Her friends is plural subject here. So, we will use only first form of verb with plural subject that is read. No S or E. Read books. She dash the plants every day. She waters the plants every day. Water is a main verb here. So, we will use S or E S with singular subject if the subject is singular. We will use S or ES with first form of verb. So, we have used S here. Fine. Okay. Now, let us start the next questions. So, six number questions answer is lives. He lives with her parents. He lives with her parents. He is a singular subject here. Lives. We will use S with first form of verb with her parents. Cows dash on grass. Cows is plural subject here. Cow is a singular subject. So here cows is a plural subject. So we will use only first form of verb that is feed on grass. Number 8 is like because Rohan and Sanya dash to play card games. Rohan and Sanya two names are given here. So subject plural subject is that who is more than one so rohan and sanya two persons are there so we'll use only first form of verb if the subject is plural so like is main verb to play card games i dash at a bank i work at a bank as i is also in counted in plural subjects so we'll use only first form of verb i work at a bank no s or yes you respect elders. You respect elders. You is plural subject. You respect elders. Okay. Now, I also have given you some sentences for translations. So, now let's have a look at the answers. Vah ye kitab padta hai. He reads this book. Vah ye kitab padta hai. Because the sentence is वह ये किताब पढ़ता है लास्ट में ता है का यूज भी है और वह वह इफ आई एम सेइंग वह ये किताब पढ़ते हैं देन इट विल बी प्लूरल दे रीड दिस बुक इफ द सेंटेंसेस वह ये किताब पढ़ती है देन इट विल बी शी शी रीड्स दिस बुक सो अकॉर्ड इट डिपेंड्स अकॉर्डिंग टू द सेंटेंस लास्ट पहचान ही रीड्स दिस बुक your second uh, question is हम खिलौने खरीदते हैं we buy toys we buy toys हम is plural subject here we buy toys only first form of verb will be used with plural subject मैं उसे जानता हूँ मैं is also in plural subject I know him I is a I is a subject plural subject no is main verb and then him object वह बहुत शोर करते हैं दे मेक अ लॉट ऑफ नॉइस वह बहुत शोर करते हैं दे मेक अ लॉट ऑफ नॉइस वह करते हैं ठीक है जी सेंटेंस की लास्ट की पहचान से हमें क्लियर होता है कि सब्जेक्ट क्या होगा और सेंटेंस सिंपल प्रेजेंट है या कौन सा टेंस है ये विच रूल्स वी हैव टू यूज फाइन ओके नाउ 
वह हमेशा सुबह जल्दी उठती है शी ऑलवेज गेट्स अप अर्ली इन द मॉर्निंग उठती है सो सब्जेक्ट इज शी हेड ऑलवेज गेट्स अप अर्ली इन द मॉर्निंग ऑलवेज इज ऑल्सो की वर्ड ऑफ सिंपल प्रेजेंटेंस वह अपने खाली समय में टीवी देखती है देखना मेन वर्ब है उसके साथ ती है लगा हुआ है ठीक है जी तो शी इज अ सब्जेक्ट हेयर शी वॉच इज टेलीविजन इन हर फ्री टाइम वॉच इज मेन वर्ब सो वी हैव यूज ई एस विद वॉच इज दर्ब एंड एन ओ एस एच सी एच डबल एस विल यूज ई एस टू मेक इट प्लोरल फाइन मैं पंजाबी भाषा बोलती हूँ आई स्पीक पंजाबी लैंग्वेज वह बहुत बहाने बनाता है ही मेक्स मैनी एक्सक्यूज सो गाइज आई होप यू अंडरस्टूड द लेसन एंड इंजॉयड इट मच थैंक यू